Hey piggy people, so I'm here with Apple. Apple Dumpling is having some problems again. So if you guys remember, it was about, well, I don't know, is that four months ago or so? That she had bladder stones. So her bladder stones went into her urethra and got stuck. She was still able to pee, but obviously it was extremely painful and it would not come out. So she had to be put under and my vet had to end up making a small cut in her urethra to allow the stones to come out. Her recovery was pretty rough because obviously making that cut in her urethra every time she would pee it was really painful. Even on pain medications and she would have an absolutely drenched bum morning and night so I had to bath her. So I feel like we're back at the same thing where I'm pretty sure it seems like she must have a stone in her urethra again. So we will be going for an x-ray to see what's up and I guess get a game plan from then. So as for right now I have her on pain medications and every single night I have to wash her bum because she will have a wet bum and I don't want her to get urine scald or God forbid her yeast infection back. So it really, really sucks. Um, she's doing pretty decent for like eating and drinking and stuff like that. It just absolutely breaks my heart when they're not feeling right and you can't tell them what's going on. They have no idea why they hurt. And she's just the sweetest little thing. I just absolutely hate that this is happening. So I know a lot of people wonder why do guinea pigs get bladder stones. There's so many reasons why they could. Like genetics could be a big reason. Her activity level, her drinking water level, just her body chemistry. You know it always could be diet. It could be age related for them not emptying their bladder properly due to arthritis. There's so many reasons. For Apple I have no clue. So, all I'm doing right now is doing pain meds, keeping her bum clean, um, I'm syringing her extra water, giving her urinary support tabs. In this syringe I have, um, it's, I can't, I don't know how you say the herb name, but it's Stonebreaker. Valerie gave us some Stonebreaker and it has this herb that's supposed to be good for cleansing the bladder and the kidneys and all that and help breaking up stones. have no idea if it does a thing but she likes the taste and it gives her extra water so can't hurt at this point. So I'll keep you guys updated for what's going to happen. Um, I really do hope that if she has stones that it's in the urethra again and it's something that we can help. I don't even want to think about if it's a big one in her bladder. So, but that's life. We're going to take it as it comes and I will let you guys know. Where are you little sweetie love? Where are you? Love you sweetheart. Try me to put a little bit more hay there. I'll get you a little bit more. Just freshen it up. There you go. No? Yes? So fresh. Your buddy Tubby's coming over. Hey, you can. Hi. Did you smell fresh hay? Did you? There's a little bit over here. Yeah. You just have to come over. You gotta share with Apple though. Don't be stealing at all. You're so cute, both of you. My two little sweeties. Let's see who else is around. There's Velvy. Can you come and get more fresh hay too? Even though your pile is brand new? Hey, Belby. 
Are you going to go to the corner house? Maybe not? Everybody else is. We've got a big bum. Hi, sweetie. Hey, Macy. We got Hawkman. And then we have Little Ray. How's everybody doing? You guys got fresh hay over here, too? I think it'll be time for Reese to have a bath soon. She has a bit of dry skin that we should wash away just can kind of see a couple little flakes on her dark fur around her bum so probably just like dead skin that we all need to scrub away hi hockey let's see everybody else we've got little Annie hi sweetie how are you? are you almost ready to go back with your sister? So about, I don't know, another week or so, I was thinking of doing it when it's Easter weekend, because I'll have an extra day off work, hopefully. And there's her sister. Hi, sweetie. Do you think you can live with your sister again, or what? And then there's trouble number one. Hi, buddy. You're so cute. That's little Angus. And trouble number two, Miss Autumn. Hi! What do you need? What's happening? I don't know that you'll ever live with your mom and your aunt, but... Off it goes. Hi, Autumn. Hi, sweetie. Hello! How are you? You're so cute. Look at that little face. How are you doing? What are we doing, Miss Annie? What's happening tonight? So Annie had no bad side effects from getting that hay out of her ear. Isn't that right? Well, now we just shook. Because a human touched us. You're so cute. Yes, you are. So pretty. If you like watching guinea pig videos, learning how to care for us, seeing product hauls or reviews, or really anything else guinea pig, please subscribe and make sure you hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. Down below I've left two more videos for you to pick from, so keep on watching!